today is day one of my five day fast. I'm having hot water with MCT oil and electrolytes. It's about 9.20 in the morning and I'm already starting to feel hungry. And I know it's because I'm fasting because I usually don't eat until like at least 11 or 12 o'clock. So I'm gonna go ahead and drink this hot water with uh, electrolytes and MCT oil and hopefully that hungry feeling is gonna go ahead and pass. My ketones this morning were 1.9. Also, just to let you know, I did weigh myself this morning. I was 151.4 on the scale. I'm about 21 hours into my 120 hour fast and I'm feeling pretty tired. Um, so I'm gonna go lay down for a little bit. Um, need to probably drink some water. I did have this morning my hot water with MCT oil and electrolytes. And um, so I'm at 21 hours. We're gonna see how it goes. It's day two of my five day fast. I am getting ready to make my morning drink. Um, yesterday I was pretty tired. Um, so after I got off work, I went and took a nap for a couple of hours and then I got up and like tried to do my dishes and clean the kitchen and do stuff like that. And then I, um, went back to bed around 10 o'clock PM. Let me see how, how many hours is it? So according to my fasting app, I have achieved heavy ketosis and autophagy. I'm at 37 hours of fasted. Um, and so I'm going to make my morning drink. Actually, this morning, I think I'm just going to go ahead and go with hot water. Um, and uh, we'll see how it goes for the rest of the day, whether I need to add any MCT oil this morning. Uh, if it gets beyond noon, I will not have MCT oil. So um, right now I'm just going to have some hot water in my kilt cup. It's going to be a busy day because today I need to be spending my time getting ready to do a training on Friday and Monday. So I have to be focused and I have to be able to think. I feel really good this morning though, but um, I did notice a slight headache this morning. I'm drinking some hot water with electrolytes this morning. So hopefully the electrolytes will be enough to to quell that little bit of a headache. I don't really want to take anything, but I will if I have to. I'm now 41 hours into my 120 hour fast. Um, I felt, started to feel a little bit hungry, so I drank some San Pellegrino sparkling water and that seems to have taken care of that little bit of hunger. Um, so far, so good. day three of my five day fast. I'm waking up feeling pretty good this morning, so I'm getting ready to do my sprints. My weight is at 148.4 and my ketones are 2.8 this morning. So I haven't really been feeling up to sprinting for the last couple of days, so um, I figured I better go ahead and get it done early. So that's what I'm gonna do. Did eight sprints, two of them at a six, and six of them at a 6.6. .6. 
had a lot of lactic acid build up in my muscles, so I had lots of itching, which is awful, but I was able to go accomplish my goal. So I'm just coming in to do my afternoon check-in. Um, it's 11.58, so just about 12 o'clock. Wanted to come in and just say how I'm feeling today. So um, I have still a little bit of a headache going on. I feel good, not great, but I feel good, uh, not bad. So <laughs> that's awesome. Uh, yesterday I was feeling pretty uh, down, like um, I didn't have the energy to really do much, although my work is uh, has been pretty effective this week, so I've been able to accomplish a lot of things, so no brain fog or anything like that. So I've been able to get a lot accomplished at work this week, which is really different. So when I was on coffee, um, I would notice when I was trying to do a longer fast that I was struggling to think straight. Uh, so this is actually pretty good um, that I am able to focus. I'm able to accomplish my goals. I have to do a big training tomorrow, so I'll let you guys know how that goes and you know whether I have any issues with my communication or anything like that. So I'm feeling pretty good about my fast. I'm just a little bit over halfway through. Um, and so, yeah, uh, it, it's going pretty good, but I'm like, oh my gosh, I'm only halfway through. <laughs> So I still have like um, another 50 something more hours to go. So yeah, I don't know why I keep doing these things to myself. Good morning. It is day four of my five day fast. My weight is at one 46.4 and my ketones are 4.0 this morning. I'm drinking hot water. I haven't added any electrolytes or anything to it yet this morning. So we'll see how the day goes. Um, I still have a very slight headache. Um, and I did take some salt yesterday and last evening I took some salt just to see if that would clear it up. So it's better this morning. Today is my big presentation, so I've gotta be on my P's and Q's. So last night, um, I noticed that I had heartburn and I wondered if my body was trying to get me to ingest some antacids. Um, I did not take anything. I just drank some water and went to sleep. Uh, and then this morning, I noticed that I was a little gassy, so I was surprised by that. Um, my eyes do look a little bit red. Um, so I haven't had any ball movements this week at all. And um, just waiting to see what's going to happen in that regard. I really wanted to just come in and mention that I today had achy legs. I haven't felt that in a couple of months. So I just wanted to put that in here as part of one of my fasting updates. My weight is at 144.4 and my ketones are at 4.5. What I noticed today is that I was able to feel my rib bones and also my hip bones while I was lying in bed. So that was an interesting feeling. <laughs> and also um, I'm having an eczema flare up on my face, uh, which was kind of surprising because I haven't eaten anything over the last five days. So um, something must be um, expelling from my body. I noticed that like right here, you can see a little bit of a redness right there. Um, and like underneath my nose, I've been rubbing it. So this is typically, you know, um, before I was on carnivore, I would have these rashes 
on my face um, and they itch. So you find yourself co constantly rubbing it. Um, I'm trying to keep from rubbing it, but I can definitely clearly see that there's a red mark there. I'm going to go ahead and put a picture of how my face looked before I went on carnivore um, and how my eczema would be activated. Additionally, during the course of the fast, I did not find myself being very, very thirsty. So I think I've only been drinking about maybe 20 to 40 ounces of water per day during the fast. So um, I expected myself to be thirstier and I really only drank when I was thirsty. So um, before fasting, I was very, very thirsty and drinking a lot of water. But uh, during the fast, I, was, I just wasn't drinking as much as I had drank in, drank in the past. I'm really excited for the fast to be over. I'm gonna have the half pound of headless shrimp boil. Um, I don't want potatoes and corn, but I do want eggs. So you want me to just substitute it for the eggs? If you can, yeah, yeah that'd be great. And um, can, is it possible to do that without the seasoning and just have like a side of uh, drawn butter for dipping? Yeah, absolutely. That's what I would like. Yes, and then I'll take sausage. Yes. Yes. Okay. So just the half pound headless shrimp and eggs. And uh, and uh, sausages. You want to add sausage in there? Yes. Perfect. Half pound. Yes. Okay. <laughs> Perfect. Anything okay. else for you? That'll do it. All Thank right. you. I have that in. I'll bring that out soon if it's ready. My husband and I are out to lunch. Mm. I'm getting ready to break my 124, 120 hour fast at 116 hours. So I'm breaking fast four hours early with some shrimp and sausages and boiled eggs. So we'll see how that goes. A few moments later. It's a half pound of shrimp, a half a pound of sausage, and two boiled eggs.